Well, this is going to be a little bit of a different video. I uh, just received uh, some boots that uh, my brother-in-law ordered and uh, they just arrived so I figured I'd do an open box of them to check them out and uh, see what they look like. These are size eight and a half. I wear like a size ten and a half to eleven. So look at that. Steel toe. John Deere brand. They're not John Deere green but John Deere brand. So, all sorts of little tags on there. I don't know what these, all these things are. What is all this? Let's see. Designed with protective, with a protective sheet, safety toe reinforcement, which protects the foot from falling objects or compression. These boots meter exceed impact 75 and compression C75, whatever those requirements are. Uh, designed with special heel and sole material and provide extra protection against accidental contact with electrical uh, electrically energized objects up to 18,000 volts. Wow. We are confident you will love your new work comfort technology boots. However, if you do not find them to be comfortable, you may return them to the store where purchased within 30 days for a full refund. Now they were ordered online. Powerful scent protection. Oh, yeah, well, they do smell like leather. I can smell them, you know, coming out the, the aroma coming out of the box. Shock absorbing energy, uh, return system, stores and releases energy. Maximum cushioning and support. Breathable from heel to toe. Moisture control properties to deep, to deep, no, to keep feet cool and dry. Okay. Antifungal, anti-mold, and antibacterial combined to prevent odor. Durable, removable, and water washable. Nice. Okay. So these are about sixty-five dollars uh, with uh, shipping and all that. So yeah, these are these are pretty nice. Got the John Deere insoles. So I'm sure you're paying a little extra for that. Yeah, everything's in Spanish, so I might uh, leave that portion in there for my brother-in-law. And then the English side is here. Talking, or taking the time to periodically clean John Deere boots. So yeah, this is a cleaning procedure, so interesting. Yeah, another piece of cardboard. Looks like a little bit of leather grease on there. Yeah, here's the other one. Yeah, these are pretty nice. Check out the bottom bottom soles here. Pretty nice tread. Yeah, steel toe. No scuffs, that's just dust from the paper. Yeah, brand spanking new. Yeah, and they smell like leather too. Real strong scent. So, yeah, again, these are size eight and a half. Uh, oil and slip resistant is what's stamped in there, so that's cool. Huh. Well, what the string is around it, but yep, John Deere emblems. Pretty nice. They're like a like a dark tan leather. So I can't try mine. Like I said, my feet. I got big feet. So my big old Klondike, uh, big feet, Bigfoot feet. So, but yeah, these are again size eight and a half. And. Yeah, I'm not sure what else to say about them other than uh, they look pretty nice. They're genuine leather and got all sorts of safety features and all that stuff. So there's some kind of sticker, micro pack, recyclable. Uh, it must be the paper. So okay, but uh, yeah, lots of paper on the inside. What does it say in here? Uh, the size eight and a half medium. Uh, Dan Post Boot Company style JD four six nine one. For those curious, ah, uh, of course, made in China. Yeah, where? Why would they be made? Why would cowboy boots be made in the United States anymore? Huh? Um, what that eleven two thousand fifteen feet? I don't know what that is. So, balance man made. Okay. Well, there you go. These darn things were made in China. So, <laughs> nice little pattern on the 
on the top there. You probably can't see it; it's stitched in. But yeah, it's got some some stitching on there on the top for design. So, well, yeah, there you go, John Deere boots. And again, um, these came from. Oh, I'll have to put that in the description. I guess that was on the packaging, and I threw that out. Um, yeah, eight and a half JD four six nine one. It is the model number. Men's eleven crazy horse uh, STPO. So, all right. So, yep, there you go. John Deere boots. So, uh, yeah, not much more I can tell you about them. But again, I'll. I'll put them in the description where we bought them from. So until the next thrilling video, adios.